you can hardly send a man who could be the next president to prison because of Michael Cohen's testimony, the guy who was, he was actually exposed for embezzling $60,000 out of the Trump organization while he was on the stand, in addition to his other crimes. A lot of times what people do is they embezzle money out of you by threatening to bring a story, whether it's true or not. And there was a guy who was the doorman at the Trump Plaza who claimed that he knew there was a woman who had Donald Trump's love child and, and that he was gonna go to the Inquirer and expose this before the election. And so he ended up making like $30,000, the Inquirer had $30,000 to suppress the story because it was just a lie. But in addition to everything else, there's a woman who testifies that Trump had a child. So the guy was embezzling money, trying to get money with a fake, and, and it, it proved to be a fake story. The woman said, no, that isn't true. I don't know where he got that from. And the doorman was just trying to hustle some money. You can make money off of putting a celebrity or a politician in a jam from an, in an election cycle. This stuff goes on.